Welcome back, you savages. We are about to get into my 10 favorite movies to play during the whole Halloween season. So without wasting any more time, making the list at number 10, we got The House is October Built. This movie is a found footage style film that follows five friends who set out on a road trip in search for the scariest and realest haunted house attractions. Everybody loves a good scare, which is why haunted houses are so popular nowadays. The thrill and the adrenaline rush of these attractions has so many people actually looking for more immersive experiences. Just don't get too carried away and end up finding yourself in McCamey Manor. Something happened to your car? Next up on the list, we got Casper, a good old 90s October classic. Starring Christina Ritchie and Malachi Pearson as the voice of Casper, Ritchie, who plays a teenage girl named Kat, moves into a haunted mansion with her father to help get rid of its ghostly inhabitants, which is where she meets and befriends Casper, the friendly ghost. Nothing gives you that October feeling more than a haunted mansion, ghost, and a Halloween party. Next on the list, we got a movie called Hellfest. This film follows a group of teens who attend a horror theme park on Halloween night, but soon the scares seem to become more real once they find out there's an actual serial killer ready to stalk them throughout the park. Help me! Please help me! <laughs> you can just do it. Much like haunted houses, horror theme parks are becoming very popular around the world. You guys let me know down in the comments if you've ever been to a horror theme park before. You came here to be scared, right? I can't arrest people for doing their job. Welcome to Hellfest. Next up at number 7, we got scary stories to tell in the dark. Now if you didn't know, this movie is based on the book series that came out in the 80s and 90s. In this film, we follow a group of kids who explore a haunted home on Halloween night. There they find a book filled with horror stories, which they take home. They soon face horrifying consequences when the book itself starts writing horror stories for each of them. Andy! Stella! Listen, you're in the next story. We're reading it right here. It's a corpse looking for her missing toe. <laughs> There's nothing like some creepy scary stories to set the tone for a chilling Halloween night. Just be very careful to not let those words come off the page. We've got to stop it. Up next on the list we got Saw. It wouldn't be a scary Halloween without a gritty, nerve-wracking Saw movie. For seven years straight, we were treated with a Saw movie in the month of October leading up to Halloween. Newspapers started calling him the Jigsaw Killer. Looks like our friend Jigsaw likes to book himself front row seats to his own sick little games. The Jigsaw Killer and Billy the Puppet terrorized our screen for years and continue to still do so. You better be giving out good candy to trick-or-treaters or you might find yourself face to face with Jigsaw. There's a way out of here! There's a way out! I'm sick of it all! We're out of time. At number 5, we got Monster House, one of my favorite animated Halloween movies. This movie captures that cozy fall season atmosphere with the cinematography and storytelling. <laughs> Following two kids, DJ and Chowder, who embark on a camping mission to uncover the truths of their mysterious neighbor and his haunted house. Have you ever lived near a creepy house where the neighborhood deemed haunted? Share with us down in the comments. Freeze! Tree? Don't look back. I look back. Making the list at the number four spot, we got Scream. You can't have a Halloween without a good scream in it, and nothing beats the original. What's the point? They're all the same. Some stupid killer stalking some big breasted girl who can't act, who's always running up the stairs when she should be going out the front door. It's insulting. There are certain rules that one must abide by in order to successfully survive a scary movie. Ghostface became such an iconic costume to wear during the Halloween season 
the mask, the robe, the knife, and the iconic line that we've all tried to impersonate, what's your favorite scary movie? If you find yourself home alone passing out candy this year, make sure you pop this movie in. Just don't forget to lock the doors. Never, ever, ever under any circumstances say, I'll be right back. Cause you won't be back. You get another beer, you want one? Yeah, sure. I'll be right back. At number three on the list, we got Hocus Pocus. There's no way that we could forget about this 90s Disney classic. This is such a feel good comedy Halloween movie. It's one that you can watch with the whole family. Have some good laughs while you're eating your favorite candy and treats. 300 years later, it's Halloween Eve, and they're back. Uh-oh. We're home. Are you boys a little old to be trick-or-treating? Your Halloween night will be far better than Max's night in this movie. It's not every day that you accidentally resurrect three dead witches. How bad can it be? Coming in at the number two spot, we got trick-or-treat. And of course, it's not Halloween unless there's a little bit of trick-or-treating. And here we have Sam to show us the way. With four creepy horror stories to follow in this movie, this film leaves us wanting more out of the Halloween night. The Halloween school bus massacre. Always remember the rules of Halloween or you just might see a special trick-or-treater this year. At the top of my list, we have Halloween 4. You know we couldn't leave the King of Halloween off of this list. This was one of the first Halloween movies I ever watched. Coming back home from a night of trick-or-treating and having this movie play in the background. <laughs> if you're having trouble deciding which Halloween movie to watch, start your night off with this one. Now, Michael Myers has come home. He has returned for one more night of unholy terror. And there you guys have it, my 10 favorite movies to watch during the Halloween season. You guys let me know down in the comments what are some of your favorite movies to watch on Halloween. If you guys did enjoy the video, don't forget to drop a like. If you're new here, don't forget to sub for more future content, and I hope to catch you on the next one.